I'm gonna try to do a full day of working point pickup. I started with the first order you can get in the morning, which is a 7.45, and I got an 8.45 because I woke up at six, and around like 6.05, the 7.45s and the 8.45s drop in my area. So I got those two orders, and I'm gonna try to work a full day. Usually I only work from like 10.45 to like 1.45. I don't really work that long. But today I am determined to work a full day's worth and we'll see how many orders I can get. I am running late to this one right now. It is 7.45 right now. I'm only about three more minutes till I get to the Walmart so I'll be fine. But I had to let my animals out and feed them. So I'm on my way to do that. I'll show you guys hopefully today the process of me getting the next order. I will try to remember to screen record. I wasn't able to show you guys last time. And then I will just do the same thing as the last video where I will just put me unloading the groceries next to like the process of what I did for that order. Again, I do just do grocery orders. I don't do general merchandise and I don't do express. Sometimes I'll do express, but most of the times I wait extremely long amounts because it makes me go inside and I don't think it tells the Walmart people exactly when I've arrived because you don't put like in a parking spot or anything when you do express you just confirm that you're picking up and then you go inside and wait but yeah I don't know where I just left off and I'm sorry if you can barely see me the sun is right here in front of me but yeah I will show you guys everything today I'm, I'm hoping I get a good amount of orders today it is Monday it, usually the weekdays aren't really that bad yeah I'll see you guys when I get to the Walmart I will screen record when I arrive, but um, I usually just pull into the parking spot and wait for them to come out. And right now I know my Walmart, their freezers on the side I usually pick them up are down so they have to go to the other side of the store. So the delay times are a little bit behind, so I'm hoping that doesn't cause too much of an effect. I'm gonna be picking orders up today and like the time, because I have learned, at least in my area, weekends are great because there's a lot of orders, but Nine times out of ten, every time I try to pick up an order on the weekend, I just sit in the parking lot for like hours because they're behind, there's so many people, because there's people who aren't doing point pickup who just pick up their groceries themselves, and they're coming to pick up their groceries because it's the weekend, usually that's like the day they have off. So, I usually try not to work the weekends, but I had to yesterday, but I was only able to get two orders, and I was out there from 10.45 to almost three it was like 2 30 by the time i was like completely done like finished dropping off the order and that order was for a 12 45 order and i didn't finish it till 2 30 because i was waiting in the parking lot so but yeah i will see you guys when i get to okay guys i just got my order one of the orders was not ready yet so they canceled it which i will show you guys what that looks like if you guys are ever waiting way too long or it's past the little timer that they have or let's say someone says like the order is not ready have walmart cancel them because if you cancel like if you hit like when it says like do you want to keep waiting and you hit you remove yourself you don't get paid for that but if you have walmart cancel it for you you'll get paid for it you won't get paid like the full amount i think i just got paid only like four dollars because it was originally split up i'll look at it it was either four or seven dollars and you just basically get like the base pay and sometimes it's a little extra just depending I guess on like how long you waited but yeah so he canceled that for me so that I could still get paid for it which is good so now I just have one order on this batch but that's okay because I still have an 845 and I'm starting early today but yeah you'll run into that where the orders as some Walmarts won't be ready I noticed with this one that I go to a lot of the times their orders aren't ready sadly but I'm gonna drop this order off and then We'll go and pick up the next one. Okay guys, we just got to the stop. I'm gonna put you guys in the truck. I just dropped off that order. I'm gonna head back to Walmart and pick up the second order. So today was an absolute bust. It is already 
12.26 and I've only done that one order you guys saw. The Walmart, I keep doing this Walmart because it's right next to where I live but they always have some issues and I just keep going here and you think I would like learn like maybe I should go to a different Walmart but I just keep coming to this one. I've literally been waiting in the parking lot since I finished that 7.45 order waiting for different orders and I'm waiting for like two hours I'll call them They're like oh you're not even checked in and I'm like okay well I've been here for like over two hours and they're like okay yeah we're so sorry and like their freezer's down I understand that but I'll see like every single car that when I pulled in will all be gone and new cars will come and they'll get their orders and there's somebody I know who's a delivery driver and they'll get their orders like as soon as they pull into the parking lot and like I don't like being rude or causing like confrontation so I'm just like waiting patiently and then I'll call them and try to like remind them like hey I'm still out here and they'll be like yeah what's the name okay what bay are you in I've been waiting like I was hoping I was gonna get so many orders done and I've done one not even like a double batch like a single order and the order they did cancel for me I thought I was getting paid for it and I didn't because I guess on Walmart's end they didn't put the option I'm guessing for me to get paid so I didn't get paid for the order they canceled that I was waiting for like two hours for and so the other there's two more orders I was waiting for and instead I just contact a point pickup because I waited like almost two hours again and I called them twice to like remind them that I was still out there and they just said yeah sorry our times are a little bit longer and I was like okay that's fine like I didn't want to be like oh I've seen other people who just came in I was just like okay so yeah today was not a productive day I'm gonna try to go to a different Walmart but now the orders that are dropping right now are for like 245 so I just wasted like a whole day for like seven dollars I'm gonna drive to the other Walmart and hopefully maybe a ready to pick up order will be available because right now there is just the store I just left and they're all ready to be picked up but I really don't feel like sitting in the parking lot for another three hours. Okay guys, I went to a different Walmart. There's no orders right now for this Walmart, but I did get coffee. I went to Lasseter's and I got a white chocolate gingerbread house. Not gingerbread house. A white chocolate gingerbread uh, latte. So good. But yeah, I'm just gonna wait, hoping an order will come through. If this video is a flop, I'm so sorry. I'm hoping it's not, but I will talk about some lingo on the point pickup. So there's some keywords to know when you're doing point pickup as far as like getting orders and stuff. So if there's an order that says ASAP, that means that order is ready to be picked up immediately. Those tend to come out like they're already waiting for you. So those orders usually come out pretty fast. They're usually orders that either like drivers didn't make it on time or Walmart canceled from a driver to maybe pick up later or something so they needed to go out immediately so they're requesting a new delivery driver sometimes Walmart will cancel orders if your car is dirty and they'll request a new delivery driver another keyword is express so express is an option to drive for so express orders at least here you can either go inside depending on the Walmart you're in or Walmart has a designated parking spot for express orders so if you are a driver who's picking up an express order you would just go there or you'd go inside confirm your pickup and it also has a clock so you don't have to worry about that and then they will bring the items out and you just drop them off like regular grocery items another keyword is GM so GM orders are general merchandise orders those are the ones you actually have to scan when you pick them up and they tend to have multiple stops so usually general merchandise items will have up to 10 at least I've noticed drops and each drop has sometimes multiple items in that drop but they're not groceries or tend to be like just general merchandise like clothing random things from electronics stuff like that and those ones you also park in a parking spot you don't get the option to put in a parking spot you just have to wait and then they usually come out another keyword would be just regular groceries so regular grocery orders will let well it'll, it'll tell you that they're grocery orders and those ones you just go into your parking spot put in your parking spot number and then you just wait and then they'll ask for your name they'll load it you confirm it there's no scanning nothing 
you just confirm that you like that it'll take you to the next prompt and you'll just confirm it ready to pick up orders so those mean that the time has already expired or when it needs to be picked up so those ones you can pick they just are ready to be picked up immediately so you have to go to Walmart um, it doesn't have like a designated time to pick up because it's already expired and those ones you can also pick before any orders that are in your queue so if you have an order for 9:45 and a ready to pick up order comes through you can accept those same with Express and general merchandise and yeah those are like the big keywords that are on there to like kind of know and be familiarized with because sometimes Walmart people come out and ask you if you have like a GM order and I know when I first worked I didn't know what that meant I was like uh no and then I learned what that was but yeah I'm just waiting for orders nothing else came through this is a screen I usually like being on it's the availability screen and I just keep swiping for orders to come through and we just wait till one comes through and hopefully one does for this side of town but I will keep you guys updated so this is by far the worst day of point pickup I have ever done I'm at a different Walmart my brother actually works at this Walmart so I saw him so I talked to him for a little bit but I've only gotten one order so this will probably be the end of this video I'm so sorry I'm hoping I'll have a better day but this is just some days of point pickup that happened in some areas sometimes you have good days sometimes you don't and today I woke up so early so I'm just really sad that I literally started the day right when you can start it and I just ultimately failed so I'm so sorry about that but definitely check out my other videos and if you guys have any more questions just leave them down below but I will see you guys in my next video bye